because don't you get them all the time. If you're not an Apple guy or a Macintosh guy or an iPhone guy or an iPod guy or use their software for editing and stuff, I got one here that says, Alert, release report, check your account logging with their other device, 26 July 2018. And some info five one some ID number or info number, whatever it is. It's Apple Inc. Don't reply dash zero zero dot support and another number at as that's like an email address. You don't even post it. And then come here at 2607 2018 at 5 21 p.m. Oh, it's a PDF. But it's not even an email, it's a PDF. So they send you a 155.54 kilobytes PDF. And it's IDH number 6515.pdf. It's a PDF. I don't know what kind of PDF to use because I think they use some generic one off the internet. These scammers. Let's click on it. See where it takes us. Can we click on it? You should let me. Today I'm going to talk about Apple Inc. fake emails. Why? Because don't you get them all the time if you're not an Apple guy or a Macintosh guy or an iPhone guy or an iPod guy or use their software for editing and stuff. I got one here that says, alert, release report, check your account logging with their other device, 26 July 2018. And then some... Info five one some ID number or info number whatever it is. It's Apple Inc. Don't reply dash zero zero dot support and another number at as that's like an email address. You don't even post it. And then come here at twenty six zero seven two thousand eighteen at five twenty one p.m. Oh, it's a PDF. But it's not even an email, it's a PDF. So they send you a 155.54 kilobytes PDF. And it's IDH number 6515.pdf. It's a PDF. I don't know what kind of PDF to use because I think they use some generic one off the internet. These scammers. Let's click on it. See where it takes us. Can we click on it? You should let me. Come on. Open up. Ah, oh, got it. Open. Ah. See, it opens in a new window here. See. Click it to read only the charges to your Apple ID where I made that ch or changes. Okay. It doesn't even tell you Apple ID where I made it. 30th like June oh. 2018. Date and time. Thursday. Let's find Thursday, more July. information. No date. It doesn't tell you. It says only charges to your Apple ID where I made that at ch or changes. 429 to Apple ID where I made it. 30th June 2018. Date and time. Number of ID. 792323. Two no okay. Just you don't know. Can't use some of the phone until we get a response. 2018. We have no idea that your account information is being downloaded. Verified. UTC. Uh, okay. And it's got Once the case you number have an iPhone ID, or a Macintosh or a okay. Apple TV, you can't use some of the phone until we get a response. Apple we have no idea that your account information is being downloaded or it? unverified. Uh. We need to verify your Once account. Once you have an iPhone to keep or a Apple ID account, Apple you need to sign and verify as soon as possible. Blah blah blah. Apple we'll disable Watch. your Aren't account. You from the moment you use it, eventually delete 
a long email to like another data your story account. app you know, without to keep you to change your password ID as account. Okay. You need to Why sign am I changing my password as as blah, blah, blah. All, All you do is want to verify my information. It's and unfair if I am down on email to like this another oh, data store in the Type this to the Apple, Apple you should change your password as soon as dot dot Apple okay. dot com Why dot am I changing my no password dot after again. com? All you do oh. is want to verify to my verify your I didn't even recommend I'm you go to verify now. This is your oh okay. Type well, this to the Apple now. ID dot it's Apple dot com Apple dot. support. There's no dot after com. Why would oh. I go to Apple support to verify your? Usually they have some email email like you go to verify blah, 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 some Okay, guy. why am I going to verify this is now? Apple ID support. If it's this a was a journal support, Apple stuff. These why would I go to Apple support? Would be Usually they have some name hyperlink. Like tech support but not. Blah, 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 some you would guy. check the private this policy. Apple ID the support. support. If this Apple was a the support one, you would get Apple to why you got this email. The Apple These blue thing down one would be here would be your Apple ID clickable in a private hyperlinks. policy. You would check, but they're not. Tell you you would the check the policy. Private and all policy. This is all rights reserved. Copyright to Apple. The Apple link. The support one. one Apple Park. To why you got this email. The Something Apple ID one would be go to your Apple ID account. Copper in a private yeah, policy California. would check, tell you what the privacy Nine policy is and all this. And zero this one is all rights reserved. So copper to the Apple. What gets me the use one of Apple, Apple, Apple Parkway. Logo Something here. Some, I don't Isn't know. it like black and a different kind of Apple? Tune, now? Yeah, California. I don't know. Because I'm not an Nine Apple user, so I want to know what the zero one What the four, Apple so logo looks like now. It didn't, what gets me the use an old Apple. Whatever people out there know what the here. Apple logo looks like. You can Isn't tell it me. like black and a different kind of no Apple clue. Now. But that I was just know, weird getting user, this kind of what email. The, what the Apple saying. logo looks oh, like now. Blah, 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 all this crap. And at Whatever the end, people out there, I violate something. He doesn't Apple even tell me. Like you can tell me, did, but I have no clue. That's my. But first, that was just weird getting this kind of first. email saying. I think oh, I like one, blah, two, blah, three. blah, blah, all this crap. I and got three or four. E I violate e something. Email he scams. doesn't even tell me. Wish it did. Two or three months, but decided to do this because first, just to see if anybody I else got this stuff first. And Talk I about think I like one, two, you hear it on the radio or TV. I got or three or four. Some e read some red e email or some scams. Guy talking last about oh, two or three months. I talked to this. Decided to do this like because blah, 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 how many hours just to see if anybody else hours or an stuff. hour, or 15, 20 minutes talk about on the phone or on the radio or TV. I chatted somewhere online. Some read some red article. Some guy talking that about I thought was customer oh. support and a lot. I talked to the scammer for like scam like a million of dollars because also can you send me ten dollars? Can you send me hundred dollars? Because I'm gonna lose my rent. I'm gonna lose whatever. I chatted with someone online. But that was just the funniest thing. I thought was customer it. support. When I, I don't lost my have money. Apple products scam like a million of dollars. There's a few guys on ten dollars. Can you send me hundred dollars? Because I'm going to lose my rent. Talk about oh, whatever stuff. they, they oh, scam you of everything. About Apple, what their but policies are, the how they fix it, this. why they do. When blah, I don't blah, blah. have Apple, they either Apple fanboys or Apple haters. Me, I mean, there's a few guys on. I'll just on YouTube help you with your. A talk about products. This so if you were getting an email list, don't Apple click on that the blue hyperlink. The blue hyperlink. These blah, blah. ones here. See? They're either Apple fanboys or don't Apple click on it. Me, I'm either none. And don't click on this here. Just These ones you should be able to if it's a products. true. So if you were getting an email list, don't gave you click on that blue hyperlink. And it should have a blue hyperlink. These, these ones here. About. They See? should be some second click on guy here. And don't click and on this. this now. These you ones would have you should be able, able to do something else with your Apple so stuff. That's my you. first one. I got two or three more. And they should have a guy's this. name here if I haven't talked about it. They should <coughs> be some got two or three some more coming. guy here. That's my first one. And this is now. Let's find out. There's more information. Customer. It doesn't your tell Apple you. There's fully charges to your Apple ID were made at. Or changes. It doesn't even tell you. Your Apple ID were made at. 30th like June oh. 2018. This Date and time. Thing. Let's find Thursday, out more July. information. No date. It doesn't tell you. There's folding charges to your Apple ID were made at 
ch- or changes. 429 okay. Apple ID a- 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 U- 30th C- June 2018. Okay. Date and time. Case number of ID 792323. Okay. Just you don't know. Can't use some of the phone until you get a 2018. We have no account information for $429. U T C okay. Once you have an iPhone ID or a Macintosh or a okay. Apple TV you can't or use some of the following until we get a response. Apple Watch. We have no you you Reference appears to be invalid or use it. Unverified. Uh, we need to verify your Once account. Once you have an iPhone to keep you continue using the Apple ID account. You need to sign in verify as soon as possible, blah, blah, blah. Apple we'll disable watch. your Aren't account. You from the moment you use it? Eventually, delete a long email, icon, and other data storing app. Without Apple to keep you to change your password as soon as possible. Account. Okay. You need to Why sign am I changing my password? As as blah, 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 blah. All we'll you do is want to verify my information. It's unverified, un long emails, icon, this is your other oh. data storing app. Type this to the Apple should change your password as soon as possible. Apple okay. dot com Why dot am I changing my no password again? Com. All you do oh. is want to verify to my verify your identity. I'm verifying. You undelic. go to verify now. This is your oh okay. Type well, this to the Apple a now. ID dot Apple dot com Apple dot. support. There's no dot after com. Why would oh. I go to Apple support to verify your? Usually they have some new recommend you go to verify blah, now. Blah blah blah. Some okay. Guy. Why am I going to verify this is now? Apple ID support. If it's this was a, a Apple support Apple stuff, These why would I go to Apple support? Would be clickable. Usually they have some name hyperlink. Like te- okay, now I got another email here. It says Canada Road Agency A R C dash two zero one. Click blah blah blah. Canada tax revenue. Let's click on it. We'll open up. Ah, it opened up. So. Here's the Canadian Revenue Agency tax refund. Wednesday, July, Wednesday, 25th July, 2018, 19, 1900 hours, 46 minutes, 15 seconds, and GMT. We are re- you are registered to receive most email from the Canadian Revenue uh, online instead of a uh, paper in email. I don't remember sending email, sign up for email online. After the final, to a the annual calculation of fiscal return that you're an eligible for the receive a tax return four oh three two seven I don't think they do this here. Yeah, see with a valid credit card, please submit a tax return request by having your tax refund sent to a to a valid credit card within twenty four hours. They don't do this. Here's the tax stuff here too up top see that's like a post like an ID tracking to me, that's my email address, if you guys wanna know. And then all this stuff here, it's in French. I think they copy and paste it from some stuff on um, a bunch of the, probably from online, these scammers, who's another stuff, another, yeah. I'm gonna show you this stuff. Don't worry about this stuff on this side. But here, fo- please follow the instructions on your screen once you uh, reach our secure server. Yeah, a secure server, there's a secure server. It might be like, I don't know, five, six, maybe eight, maybe nine, maybe ten laptops or computers. If they want to spend the money to make a online server, but if they do have some that well. Please follow the instruction on your screen once you have reached it, blah blah blah. Yeah, that's a totally fake email. Don't click on the hyperlinks like I said in the last one. And sorry about my audio last one if it's lower. I was trying out something. I'm new to this capture stuff, but this is the weirdest stuff here. See, Canada River Agency. No, it would have the government of Canada logo someplace that doesn't have it. It would probably have also like some other where Canada River logo is also. What the Canada River Agency is. If you're in the states, you got the IRS Internal Revenue System. We got the uh, we got the CRA, the Canadian Revenue Agency. It has some logo someplace and it has some government stuff, and plus have a probably a like address from them or to call this number, or blah blah blah, or, or to check to sell or go to the w- website, put this in, blah blah blah. Go to some website, put this ID number in, or 
you know, to check it, so it was all right. It's flagged. Even, I think, um, Microsoft Hotmail, or Outlook, we want to call it, flagged it with this, with this red thing over here on this side. With this red, you know, the thing there, the thing, I forget what they call it. I used to know stuff, but um, that's what they probably did. So that's not email. I got a couple more kind of funny ones. So that's that one. I'm going to go to the next one in a minute here. I have to screen caps and all. I'm back again with another email I found um, from CIBC Online Banking. I don't use CIBC, I'm an RBC guy. If you're in the States, CIBC is Canadian Imperial Banking of Canada. And if you're also in the States, you must have seen RBC a few times in arenas like NHL, maybe a couple other things. RBC stands for Royal Bank of Canada. But anyhow, we could just go on. It says case number, inactive, whatever that means. I know what it means, but whatever that means to them. Say we see online banking secure notification action required at blah 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 and it doesn't tell you. oh you can open a new window and it has my email address again online bank that says the date here you can't open it up too much if you check your if you do it on your smartphone you can get more information which we're going to do after I talk about this year because the recent updates in the system Eric is getting some of your account information must be updated update for what if you don't have if you don't have an IP CIBC online banking or have a CIBC account, why click on it and it tells you, oh, click here. And if you click here and you can read, that's a safe link dot protection outlook dot com, parable, all this thumbnail stuff. It does mean something, that stuff. If you're an email expert, you would know it. I'm not. I'm just a guy who's trying to warn people about this stuff because it's kind of weird to get it. It's like weird to get in the first place. That's a scam. It's a major scam, man. It's just like, oh, I don't know what to do here. So I'm going to go to the next email. Same email, but on my phone to show you what the whole thing looks like. That's what it looks like on ho Hotmail. Or wait, no, where Microsoft's called it now. I think Outlook now is called. Hotmail is called Ho Outlook. So this is what Outlook looks like on the laptop, the computer, or even, I think, if you got a tablet, like the new Microsoft stuff, tablets, you know, those things are two in one where you take a tablet. Yeah, it's all the same. I don't know what it looks like a Mi and Macintosh will look like, because I don't have Macintosh stuff. But anyway, that's what it looks like here. So I'm gonna go to the next email. The same email, but next capture screen, and we'll be back. Okay, now I see the email I was talking about last time about the CIBC. Here's what the full email looks like. It's a CIBC online bank. I think they will have a logo here too, but I'm not too sure what their emails look like. And then you go scroll down. You can scroll down here. It says because a recent updates in our system. See, I talked about this. This is what the email looks like on my smartphone, a Samsung. Galaxy Note 7 Edge. Yeah. And you, it says here, reconnect account. Why would I reconnect account when I don't have one? That's another one. And this here is hyperlinked. This stuff here. There's no hyperlink. There's nothing else in this email. That's all. It doesn't tell me why I'm having trouble with my update the system. That's a scam. Don't click on it. It says here, Tuesday, 21st of August, 2018. At zero zero fifteen twenty GMT. I don't know if they have anywhere in the other side of the world. That's a scam. So if you see this stuff, don't click on it whatsoever. Don't click on the hyperlinks. Don't click on that. Says, oh, connect here. I know you see this. Just like to click on this stuff because you think it's all cool. It's not. It's gonna get you your emails. Uh, See, so I see online banking. 
it tells you to click on here click on there don't click on anything to scam is a major scam just to fraud you over. say you have a thousand bucks in your bank account that's for pay rent and say it's through uh, say you got a thousand bucks but your rent ain't due for another two days the only time you can go pay rent is on a certain day they tell you or a car payment and don't take the money out of your bank account yet you're waiting for like insurance or your rent or your telephone or your cable or your whatever you pay maybe Netflix or streaming service you have or whatever we need that money to be taken out so you can buy groceries then cup the day it takes the money the bank you can go to your bank and ask oh I got this email you can do that but or you can take it to the police and show them this stuff but I don't think the police will do anything with this stuff because you know why it's because got some stuff on their plate right now you must get these like at least I don't know like a thousand a day or a hundred a day or fifty a day like in Manitoba Saskatchewan doesn't matter where all they get these emails from but I thought I'd show you this guy's stuff because it's bugs me the heck out of it when you get it all the time and you can't do like about it but if you make a video about it and we talk about it yeah we'll get a, we'll get someplace about it to warn people so that's the email I'm gonna sign off now I have to edit this and do a bunch of other stuff with it. it might take me a couple days or so signing off now goodbye <laughs>